The girl was very lonely. It so happened that she hurt her leg. She had no choice but to stay home and recuperate. When she was bored, she started to make friends on the internet. She became addicted to the internet. She didn't even look at the debt collection letters in front of her. She just held her cell phone and played every day. On that day, the girl received a text message and realized it was a male netizen. Knowing that it was a man, the girl smiled and chatted with him. Pink felt that the other side of the humor and sense of fun. So they talked about their own aspirations for the rest of the night. The next day, Pink wanted to call him, but the phone didn't work. She immediately sent a text message to him, but she waited for a few hours, but she didn't hear back from the man. This made Pink very disappointed. In that evening, Pink received another text message from the boy and smiled with satisfaction. Pink tried to chat with him on social media, but the boy said that their place is very backward and there is no computer at all. He also said he had been lying at home for 100 days and was very lonely. Pink sympathized with him because she had been lying at home for 100 days too. She feels the same way. She said the boy could talk to her when he was bored. After some conversation, the two of them got to know each other better. The boy offered to swap selfies. Pink immediately agreed. But when Pink sent the photos to him, he sent back a photo of Pink. She was surprised and felt that the boy was playing a trick on her. 